Hey YouTube, this is Mobile App Review with a tutorial on how to get Virtuous Picasso on your A500. This ROM is done by MDJ. The previous ROM I did was Prime, which was done by Dexter NLB. Both of the ROMs are based on the EPAD transformer. Uh, this ROM is faster, in my personal opinion. Um, you could check out my review of that of Prime and check out my review of this to see which one really will work for you. This one I like because of the 1080p and the 720p and the included app of Friend Me. Um, all of those aren't big reasons to like an app, but it was big enough for me to choose it. It also had, comes with the 3G modem support and some improved ext4 performance so check out this form uh, that's in my description check out my reviews of it uh, so let's get into it first things first you're gonna need to have a uh, clockwork mod installed on your Acer Icon A500 um, I've already done a, a tutorial on how to get that done using Acer recovery installer so check out my channel for that um, next thing if you're going to be using connecting your A500 to the computer to put the zip file on the micro SD, then you're going to need to download the USB driver. Um, download link is in the description. Um, you don't have to do it that way. That's the way I did it. You can also just connect your micro SD to the computer, transfer on the micro SD, and then put it on, the, and then put it in the A500. Either way works. Um, to download it, go to the link. Um, go to download, download, uh, multi upload was the fastest one for me, so that's the one I chose. Um, once it downloads the zip, I would suggest extracting one or two files to make sure it's not corrupt. If it is corrupt, then you're going to have to re download it. You don't want to flash a corrupt zip, that will make big problems for you. Do not flash a corrupt zip. Alright, so no errors here, so it's fine. Um, next thing you're gonna need to do is to connect is gonna to put it on the micro SD. Um, if you're gonna if you're doing it the Iconia connecting your Iconia to a computer you're gonna click on Iconia, go to device storage, and look for micro, the micro SD folder. And you're just gonna drag it onto it, and that's it. After you get the Clockwork mod on there, you download this and drag it on. That's it. All you have to do now is this flash it. So stay tuned for that one. I'm about to show you how to flash it okay, correctly. You too. Next, after you get, um, follow my first few steps from the computer and everything's on your thing, you're going to have to turn off your your Iconia. Um, then when that's done, you're going to boot into the Clockwork Recovery Mod. You're going to do this by holding the power key and the down key, which is the far left part of the, the volume key. And you're going to keep continue holding it until you see till you see um, a fourth line pop up uh, it says boot and recovery kernel image and you're going to be booted into the clockwork recovery mod um, this is version 5.0 um, 4.4 all of those are the first version works just the same um, first you're going to need to do is wipe data factory reset all the way down to yes then you're going to do wipe cache partition Yes. Then you're gonna go to, to advance. Now I don't know if this is necessary, but I do it just in case. You're gonna wipe Dalvik cache is the second one down. Go to yes. 
Then you're going to do white battery stats. And you're going to hit yes. Next, you're going to go into, you're going to go back. Then you're going to go to install zip from SD card. Then you're going to do choose zip from SD card. And you're going to choose virtuous Picasso version 1.0.3 zip. Now to select an item, I should have set this in the beginning, you hit the power key. This is it installing. Just want to reiterate, I recommend you doing it on a micro SD and not on the device storage itself. Um, I haven't done it on the device storage, um, so I'm just telling you the way that I've done it, um, which works. So I wouldn't suggest trying some other way. So just make sure you use a micro SD card. Um, if you have any uh, trouble with this, just either PM me, uh, comment, or go to the forum, uh, sign up, and, and post um, your problem in the, in the thread. It doesn't take that long, it just takes like one or two minutes to install. All right, install from SD card complete. Once that's done, you're gonna go back and you're gonna do reboot system now. And it's just gonna reboot the first boot up is always the longest. This is the boot up animation. Um, it's going to take a while. Alright, now it's done booting, it'll take you to the welcome startup screen, the, the little wizard. So, and now you have completely flashed your first custom ROM on your Acer or Kanye A500. Um, make sure you check out the thread and make sure you donate to both of these developers, MDJ and Dexter. They've done uh, a lot of work. Don't forget to thank SC2K and Thor. Um, none of this would be possible without them, so check out the threads. Um, all the links are in my description. Um, I didn't, if you guys really need me to do a little, 
a written tutorial I'll do that too uh, I'm not a typer I don't like typing so I did, just did a video review so make sure you check out all the links uh, I'm not gonna do a direct link to the um, download you're gonna have to go to the forum to check it out so thank you um, make sure you check out my channel don't forget to comment subscribe uh, and like um, and if you have any suggestions just PM me um, I'm open to all suggestions so